Presentism is the view that neither the future nor the past exist. According to Presentism, events and entities that are wholly past or wholly future do not exist at all. Only the present moment exists. This is similar to Buddhism, where everything in the past and future is unreal. Only the present moment of physical reality is real. But mankind has never been able to explain presentism as a physical process using physics. The nearest we have come is the modern theory of relativity, with the conceptual observer being a geometrical point in both space and time at the apex of a light cone, which observes the events laid out in time as well as space. Different observers can disagree on whether two events at different locations occurred at the same time, depending if the observers are in relative motion. This theory depends upon the idea of time as an extended thing and has been confirmed by experiment. However, although the contents of an observation are time extended, the conceptual observer being a geometrical point at the apex of a light cone is not extended in time or space. This creates a paradox in which the conceptual observer contains nothing even though any real observer would need to be an extended contents of an observation to exist. This paradox is partly resolved in relative deep theory by defining a frame of reference to encompass the measuring instruments used by an observer. This reduces the time separation between instruments to a set of constant intervals. Some of the difficulties and paradoxes of presentism can be resolved by changing the normal view of time as a container or thing unto itself and seeing time as a measure of changing spatial relationships among objects. Thus observers need not be extended in time to exist and to be aware, but they rather exist and the changes in internal relationships within the observer can be measured as stable, countable events. The theory of relativity can never give us a complete and objective understanding of presentism because there is no cause and effect in relativity. Matter tells space how to curve and space tells matter how to move. There is no present moment that causes a future to unfold. There is just a beautiful geometrical process. But in a new theory called quantum atom theory, the universe is explained as a continuum of continuous energy exchange or continuous creation. Each individual is at the forefront of creation in the moment of now, in the center of their own reference frame as an interactive part of creation with an emergent uncertain future unfolding relative to the energy of their own actions. In this theory the wave particle duality of light and matter in the form of electrons is forming a blank canvas that we can interact with forming the possible into the actual. We have new photon oscillations or vibrations continuously coming into existence relative to the atoms of the periodic table forming what we measure as a period of time. The atoms form standing waves in time with the spontaneous absorption and emission of light or photon energy forming the ever-changing world of our everyday life that we see and feel as the passage of time. In such a theory the moment of now relative to each individual observer is the only thing that exists within a universal process of energy exchange with a past that has gone forever and a future that only exists as a probability wave function that forms the uncertainty of everyday life that at the smallest scale is represented mathematically by Heisenberg's uncertainty principle. I hope you enjoy these videos please share and subscribe it will help the promotion of this revolutionary theory that is outside of mainstream physics.